A dramatic late goal from super sub Benjamin Macanjo gave Rance three vital points at Evian last week. They came into this game with Rennes four points above the drop zone, knowing that a win would guarantee their survival. In ninth place on 50 points, Rennes have nothing left to play for except pride perhaps. They'll have been keen to avenge a 3-1 home defeat to Rance in the reverse fixture. Well, the first chance going Rennes' way. Abdoulaye Dekouro trying his look from outside the area there. Nothing too dangerous for Rance goalkeeper Kossi Agassa. Meanwhile, at the other end, a cross coming in, looking for Prince on Iyange. It was a clean connection, but that one sailing over the crossbar. And in fact, not a single shot on target in the opening 45 minutes. So goalless at the break. On the home side, getting the second half underway. Guys on Charbonnier coming on for Omanuke Mfulu in the 57th minute. That would turn out to have consequences just a few minutes later. First, though, a chance here for Ren. Paul George and Tepp's free kick well blocked. But what about this number from Abdullah Dekore? Skipping away from four defenders and getting the shot away. Needed a good pair of hands there from Agassa to clear the danger. And just a minute or two later, Rance awarded a penalty. Referee Stéphane Lenoir are judging this to be a handball from Edson Mexer. Shown a yellow card for his troubles after the attempt from David and Gog. Perhaps a little harsh, that decision. Either way, up steps Charbonnier, making absolutely no mistake, the substitute. And that was a 1-0 to Rance on the hour mark. A sixth goal of the campaign from Charbonnier. Straight up the middle. And Rance closing in on survival. That goal giving them confidence. Another chance here for Charbonnier. He didn't get hold of that one quite as well. And what about this one from Prince on Iyange? This would have been a fantastic goal. Did all the hard work, but he was denied by the woodwork. And as the replay will show you in a second, this one didn't cross the line. With goal line technology set to be introduced in Liga Up next season. And a final chance for Anders Conradsen. Having a go from distance there for Wren. And that was how it finished at 1-0. Mission accomplished for Olivier Guégan. And Rance will be back in Ligue 1 next term.